Jacqueline and Veneer have been jailed for like six months now. Get over it. Uh huh. And don't even get me started on Brozone. They don't even have a proper record label yet. Apparently, they're gonna be a solo band now. How ridiculous is that? Yup. Ugh, are you even listening to me? No, but I finished a report that was due yesterday. You're welcome, by the way. Hmm. Report, uh, whatever. Mm-hmm, yeah, yeah, I've already seen that. <laughs> Charlie, you cannot be serious. What? Really? That, that's not supposed to be in there. Hey, give that back! An entire smear campaign? Uh, let me remind you that both of us were in office when this happened. Neither of us knew about them using Floyd. Would you have done anything if you did? That's not what I was... Right. And I wasn't promoting them and their music like my job depended on it. I didn't even trust them in the first place, and I told you that. Charlie, you don't trust anyone. Exactly. And look where that got me. Uh-huh. I haven't had to do any of that. <laughs> the people want an elected official they can trust. They may not see it yet, but I will be that official. Even if it means taking you down. <laughs> oh, Charlie, you are too cute. Little Charlie, thinking he could be the big boy in this big world. I think I even remember an episode from your little show that was just like that. What does that have to do with any of this? It has everything to do with it. Let me remind you that the only reason you're here is because people thought it'd be hilarious if little Charlie was an elected official. I don't think they really care about someone they can trust. Who's to say they won't now? People may love the little Charlie from their favorite childhood TV show. But not more than me. Uh, that's right. Uh, your shoe's untied. Might want to take care of that first if you want to be big, Charlie. Doesn't flow as well, does it? <laughs>